day seven. So I feel a lot better today, you might be pleased to know. I've spent most of the day in the garden in the greenhouse. It's all slowly kind of coming together, I think. So at least it gives me something to do, that's for sure. It's been a really nice day here. I know it's supposed to be like showers and stuff, but I've been really lucky. Like, it's been lovely. And then of course it started raining, so I've had to stop to what I was doing. But I'm really pleased with how everything's looking. Put some lights up in the garden. These ones up here. I figure we might as well start treating this like a holiday. Christmas maybe? Easter? I think lights should be for any time of year, don't you? I don't know. I think I'm starting to go mad. So all the garden stuff's done. Can I take the dogs for a walk? Oh, someone is so impatient. Okay, 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 we're going. <laughs> No, it's not not gonna work for you. So apparently we're going for a dog right this second because they can't wait any longer. I don't really blame them. I've been outside all day in the garden. Not, not really outdoor dogs. They don't really like to leisure outside. Not unless there's a swimming pool or something. It's definitely going to rain. I'm going to get soaked. Ugh. The joys of having dogs. Hey dude. Living our best lives. Back in the park, nice gentle walk with the dogs again. We've not actually been to the supermarket yet. We actually kind of reasonably need to go soon. <laughs> Although, I think we're just going to try to avoid it for as soon as possible. I think that's the plan. Um, stocks are getting quite low though. Like I say, I um, probably shouldn't have panic bought paint and probably should have panic bought more useful items, <laughs> mostly food. But that's what I thought was a good idea to panic buy at the time. So I think we're going to take a little trip to spa of all the things and try and avoid the big supermarkets for as long as possible. So I did some batch cooking, so we've got plenty of soup. We just need things for like breakfasty things and we pretty much have very little vegetables now. Yeah, at least I know I've got soup and things. So yeah, I have no idea what the supermarkets are like near me as yet. Just curious now, see what they're actually like. I also need to take some food to my dad. And that's pretty much my plan. <laughs> kind of dreading the supermarket. I just want to stay home. But I don't think it's right for me to get an online delivery, especially when I'm able to go to the shop. So I'd rather leave all those slots for people that really need to, like really need the online shopping and actually can't go out the house at the moment. So yeah, so that's how I've got to say about that at the moment. Pal's living his best life in the park right there. So I shall keep you updated. So we got back from the park and decided it was probably best just to pop to our local corner shop just to get some bits and pieces and food. I don't really want to go to the supermarkets or the big ones anyway, not yet, or really for as long as possible. I also don't want to go online groceries because again, like I said, I'm not in that worrying category that has to stay inside for 12 weeks, so I would just like to alleviate as much difficulty as it is for a lot of people trying to get food shopping online, for a lot of people having quite a lot of struggles getting food delivered, especially when they can't leave their house, so doesn't make me want to go to the real supermarket anymore though. I'm pretty sure I can just live on cornflakes and microchips. It's so unhealthy. Actually our corner shop is pretty good. It's even got toilet roll and pasta. Although they are really strict on how many items you can buy. Now you can't buy duplicates of things. We tried to buy two soy milks and two coconut milks because soy milk we use for cereal and coconut milk I use for smoothies. And we were only allowed one of each, so yeah, I don't know if it's better to go to supermarkets, maybe you get a little bit more, but I have to go less often, whereas the corner shop I probably have to go a bit more often, but it's, you know, it's, it's not a hardship, we can go to the corner shop, and although this is a disruption for everybody, I think we just have to just keep going, just stay home, stay safe. And on that note, if you've enjoyed this video, do give us a like, leave a little comment. Subscribing is optional, but it is very, very much appreciated. And I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Bye!